Welcome back to the Ultimate Marvel Championships Gravitrax Eliminator Race Edition. On today's contest, we have built an awesome track, including marble runs and Gravitrax for our six marbles to battle it out on. But first things first, let's show you our track. So the marbles are going to drop in at the top, and we're going to have four vortexes of dooms, all broken up with different wheels and steps. They're going to drop down the final steps and enter the Gravitrax edition. They're going to go down the first rail and go down the blind summit, where they're then going to go into the S-Bend and through the divider. Once they go through the divider, they've got one last chance to overtake each other before rejoining for the final track and finishing up on the finish line. Introducing our six marbles competing in this race today, we have the green one, the red marble, the blue marble, and we have three chrome marbles. Hard to tell on this picture, but the first one is all chrome, the second one's half chrome, half black, and the third one is chrome with black dots. So here we go, going into race one of our first elimination match, and in we go, the marbles drop in. So it looked like the blue marble got the first early lead and gets an amazing start, drops down the hole instantly, followed by all the rest. The marbles are having a great first vortex. This is a much closer battle here, and it looks like the blue marble, although had a great start, has lost his early lead with the chrome marbles, going straight in and overtaking him, but there he goes, he drops into the third vortex. The chrome marbles are still moving forward, I'm not sure which one that is, is that the polka dot one and the spotty one, I believe, the half and half, no, there's the half and half, still stuck up, half and half's having a lot of trouble, there's the polka dot chrome one entering and makes first place. Who's going to get eliminated in this first round? Let's find out. We have another chrome marble making his way through. The red marble is safe, followed by the green marble. Green marble is absolutely fine. There goes the chrome marble, and poor in last place is the blue marble. And it looks like the blue marble is going to get eliminated, leaving the five marbles remaining to carry on battling it out. And here we go, going into race two. The five remaining marbles all get dropped in, and it was the red marble that got stuck a little bit there. Can he regain that early lead? The Crow Marble drops in early. The Reds are fighting it out. There he goes. He manages to get a little bit of time back. Can he hold on to that and not drop back into last place? Who's going to make it first through? Is it going to be a Green Marble? Yes. And the Red makes an epic comeback from last to second. Can he squeeze into first place and guarantee himself a place in the next round? Let's see. We've got all five marbles moving around. And he has. The Red moved into first place. Excellent work by the Red Marble here. And we've got all five battling out. It's still absolutely anybody's game. Who's going to break through and pretty much guarantee themselves a space? A full chrome is in. Drops into the uh, blind drop. Goes through the S-Bend, through the divider. And makes it onto the finish line. Followed by the green marble and the red marble. And which chrome one is it that's going to be last? I believe it is the chrome polka dots. Yes, it is. And the chrome polka dot is eliminated. Leaving us with the remaining four marbles to continue battling it out. We had some awesome marble racing there, epic comebacks, epic clashes, and the Gravitrax divider worked its magic. If you enjoyed this video, make sure you subscribe for more marble races, and come back tomorrow for part two of the, marble, the Ultimate Marble Championship Gravitrax Edition Eliminator Race.